Hello everyone and welcome back to Havzix Plays Spyro the Dragon and today as you can tell we're crashing right away but we're mainly picking up where we left off on this flight level that name is escaping me because quite frankly I really don't like it but that's gonna screw me up that's not hopefully I can get the rhythm down relatively quickly and not be stuck doing this one too much in today's episode. I'd really like to continue my two and done record on the each kind of realm. Okay, I'm still going to be missing another guy. Two, actually. Okay. Get you. Up here, get that. See if the other guy's coming down. He's not. So try and get everything else through here and then frantically search for that fucker because it is not exactly a smooth going episode thus far okay still somehow limping along okay I know where the two chests are one is right there the other one is right here next to that guy I'm doing a little better, but missing that guy at the front is really got me messed up. Like, really badly got me messed up. And I don't know where the last dude here is. There he is. But that's only going to give me about two seconds to get back. So, okay. Only missed one. <sighs> that was only, what, my second try? <laughs> Hopefully, I can do as smooth without messing up anything else keep that rhythm alive that was really good I think last time I was just starting to feel the exhaustion of having been playing for a little bit I had the offline quite a bit I think it actually ended up still being a somewhat why are you glitching so slowly still ended up being somewhat of a longer episode so I do think that might have just been throwing my rhythm off I was kind of running low on time Okay, do this, don't crash, and get him, go straight into that, and that, you, okay, so as long as I don't crash, which, knock on wood, it feels like I have a chance at this one, uh, getting a little nervous though, <laughs> okay, Still missing a couple of those guys. I'm going to go for the chests last, I think. Because, Well, might as well go ahead and get that one. Up the time. Okay, keep an eye out for you. Where'd you go? Okay. Don't screw this up. Don't screw it up. No. No. Okay. No, 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 oh, damn it. Okay, I do need to go for the planes first once I get back there, because going after the... <clears throat> See, these first two guys down here, I don't know why they're harder for me than the rest. Oh, I cannot take a hand off the controller for even a second. Go up a hair. Stay. Get that. The alternation here is throwing me off a bit today, too. Gosh, dang it. This is by far the hardest of these flight levels, too, that I've encountered so far. And I'm actually still not sure what the trophy is on this one. I've not even begun to consider that as a possibility. That is something I'm probably going to have to get after completing the level, if I'm lucky enough to complete the level today. At this rate, I'm thinking this might be the first time I just do literally one thing in a Spyro episode, and that is this flight. Uh, I don't think I'd do that. I'd probably... It would take more days than I'm used to recording, but I'd probably just nix some of the failed attempts like that and splice them together. But yeah, this is also very frustrating. I think I said it 
a couple episodes, damn it. Uh, that throws you off right away. Okay, I think I said it a couple episodes ago. I'm actually still without heat right now, which is a pain in the ass and is making this not heat. I'm without AC, which is a pain in the ass because it's making all of this worse by the fact that I'm just stuck in a hot box. And I have been running a... I've been having the windows open and running a fan to try and pump some of the cooler air outside into the apartment. I guess peak behind the curtain. I'm recording this in April, so it's about a month or two behind the release. I'm hopeful that by the time it's released, I have AC. Given the track record of my apartment community, I don't think that is a very high probability. That royally screwed me up. Dang, that's really going to mess me up. Okay, well, that's fine. Yeah, it felt like I had that one run on lock, but no, silly me. I somehow lost entire sight of all the planes. I was down to like, what, two? I need to remember that one's down, that one's up. Go back down, flame. You figure at this point I would somewhat have this down, like somewhat, <laughs> but nope, just gonna keep on chugging along, doing shit like that. Okay, go after this guy, backtrack and there's another one. Don't crash. It actually worked out fairly well. It's the first time in a minute I've got back on this track. Okay. Fly into them if I can. Because like I said before, the chests don't move. So I just got to get... All of these guys. One more. 14 seconds to do it. Oh my god. <sighs> that was the sound of a heart breaking everyone. That was literally just earth shattering. I had that. It's okay. Because what I've learned is the most important thing of all. And that is, if I don't mess this portion up, I can do it. Oh my god. I might take out a lot of the immediate failed attempts and just leave in the ones that come really, really close. Because... That'll add a little bit of excitement of, is he going to do it? Though, if you look at the description, it doesn't, because you'll know exactly the timestamp that I managed to pull it off. Feels like I'm going slightly faster now, too. I don't know why, but... Okay, really don't screw this part up. This is the, for some reason, this particular guy with these two lining up that way is the hardest thing for me. I fail at that so many, I feel like I fail at it more times than I actually manage to get it. Okay, now. Okay, flame. I might be using the controller that has stick drift. I just realized that. One of my PlayStation 5 controllers got the dreaded stick drift, and it has been wreaking havoc on my gaming. Okay, I'm just going to call that one. I might switch controllers if I hit, like, 20 minutes at doing this. Because I am really just wanting to freaking knock this thing out. I almost had it. Like, I had one that was close. That last one really should have done it. Not the last one I showed, probably, but that one 
the one where I just hit the waterfall, apparently. I had plenty of time to just nail that. Okay, well that sucks. Flip. Probably gonna cause me to crash into you. You're gonna have to make you're gonna make me backtrack, which is gonna cost me time that I don't have. Okay, that's fine. Oh shit. Okay. Yep, well that was an accident anyway. I hope everyone knows for the record. I don't know when I'm going to actually succeed at this, so this might also be cut out too, but I'm just going to start giving a timestamp update. We are 13 minutes into me attempting this. Just today. That doesn't even count the last episode where I just angrily quit. We are 13 minutes in in today's recording of me attempting this. And now... I missed him again, which is just fucking awesome. It's exactly what I want to do. Okay. Get you. I don't know where you are. I don't know where he is. There he is. Got him. Okay. Hoo -hoo -hoo. That's some fancy flying there, Spyro. Keep it up. Okay. Immediately go for the planes. I think they get you a little bit more time than the chests. I could be wrong, but my goal is to fly into all of them, if possible. Okay, so loop around. I don't know how many chests I have left. I just know where they are. So get you, get you. Oh my God. And I got the trophy, so I don't have to do this again. Hell yes, no. Fucking quit. That was bullshit, everyone. I hated that. Huh. That might be the maddest this game has made me. That was some, like, crash-level rage that I had coming back. Like, crash has seeped into me now, where I, I just get a little bit of a... a little bit of a trigger finger when it comes to getting mad at bullshit in games. Okay, so... I'm done with Wild Flight. Can move on. There's two more levels. See what the next one is. I did. Yes, I did Misty Bog. Okay. So I guess the next one's over here somewhere. Oh yeah, it's over here behind this uh, this tree. Yeah, it's over here. We're going to the treetops. Blue? Nope. That's fine. I just killed that chick for no reason. I'm ready to be out of the bayou. I'm tired of this foghorn leghorn bullshit. Ugh. That's a nice shot of him just facing me. Entering the treetops. Oh, this is the one, isn't it? Oh, screw you. I think this is the... Okay, so 500, and then there's three dragons. I think this is the level that I was thinking about with the really, really shitty... Huh, that's interesting. I'm off to backtrack to that. Yeah, this is the one I think that is the really shitty dragon. Like, downright deplorably shitty to get dragon. <laughs> okay. I don't know if I'm... Oh, hey, I found a key. I'm glad I came this way first. It's a happy little accident. I might go ahead and backtrack now and check out that spot at the beginning that has the fly back up and see if there's anything down there. See if there's a chest down here. Anything? Nothing that way. I do know... Yeah, I think this is the one that has the really crappy to get to dragon. Like, maybe the worst dragon in the game. 
Wow, that was no. Oh, fuck. I know what this is for. God damn it. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah, this is the supercharged level, everyone. This is, like, the level... There are other things in this game, like I said, I wasn't able to figure out until I was an adult. This is probably the level that, as a kid, is why I was unable to do any better than... Oh, there's a red one, too. Uh, this is the one that would have knocked me out as a kid. The one that would have prevented me from getting absolutely everything. Oh, and there's where the chest goes. I already forgot how much I said. Is it 500? Yeah, 500. So I'm almost a fifth of the way there on this. There's my first dragon also. I'll get you here in a second, buddy. First dragon of the episode. That took a while. Uh, we have Isaac. Spyro, if you jump at the end of a supercharge ramp, you can really go far. I'm all over it. <sighs> And what did I say about the Foghorn Leghorn stuff, Isaac? Shit. Yep, already starting off great here, everyone. Okay, jump! Okay, stop that for a second. So I can backtrack to make sure I get everything. Get that. Okay. Might have been worth trying to keep the supercharge a little bit. I've also not seen a life for sparks in this one either, which is gonna suck if I lose him. Oh, there's your turn home. Okay, that's not where I wanted to go. There's a chicken. I hear that stupid. There's not an egg either, so that is literally. Oh, that was a blue one. Um, excuse me? Okay, that sends me back here, so what is it that I need to do? Where do I need to jump? Oh, I might need to get to the top. I also still lost the green one. I don't know where he is. Alright. Nope. That doesn't do it. Huh. What does... How? I'm confused already. See, this is why I hate this level. Okay, I'm gonna do this one more time, and then if this doesn't work, I'm gonna look it up. Okay. So, maybe I need to go around? Nope, that was bad. That was bad. I'm gonna fall. Okay. I'm gonna look it up, everyone, so I'll be back in a moment. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and backtrack for the sake of the first one. Kind of stop there. I'll probably have to stop the recording again because as you can tell, I am doing something ridiculously stupid right now that I forgot to jump for. Okay, I'll try that again. So I gotta do this really weird, complicated run and jump here. And... I don't know how many tries this is going to take me. What I do know is that this isn't the only time I have to do something like this in this level. And it's probably going to take every single one of these lives that I have built up. I don't know what has come over me. Maybe it's because I did the flight level first. Maybe it has mellowed me out to the point that I'm just like, yeah, sure, whatever, this jump thing, I'll die. Yeah, that's fine. That's a waste of life. Who cares? Oh, my gosh. I think the thing that makes me matter is that I almost did it. I just forgot the jump. And the, uh, actually, the thing that makes me the absolute maddest is the clip I watched of the person explaining this. They just one-tried it. Oh, okay. This is such bullshit. It's all I can say. That is literally all I can say, is that this is... Whoever designed this level deserves a special place in video game hell. I fucking did it again. Oh my god. I think it's because it's not a ramp up. Okay, if once I inevitably die here, I'm going to no longer have 20 lives. Okay, keep, keep on going without... Okay... 
Okay, that's fine. Got him. That's the first one. This is also as far as I looked up, so I don't know what what I need to do next. So I might have to offline again here in a second. Because I'm not 100% certain. So before I even leave this spot, I am going to offline again to double check what's next. So I will return momentarily again. Okay, so this part is actually pretty easy. This is just a little area that I apparently missed. I'm kind of impressed that I pulled that off. Oh. Oh, I forgot I died. Screw you guys. That's fine. I'll get everyone again. And it's okay because, yeah, this will get me back up to 21 for sure. And, like I said, I'm just on my way to an area that apparently I could have gone earlier. I'm kind of glad I didn't because it's going to let me... going to let me actually... Uh, let me get Sparks kind of healed. Oh, uh, no, it might not. Dang. Anyways, yeah, I'm kind of glad... It, it, I was able to get through one of the really hard parts, one of the first really hard parts. There is still one more, and it's the one I remember. So I know that I've got a little ways to go, but there's also this life here. Okay. Looking good. Thought I saw something floating there for a second. Get it. Get it. Okay, so we're down to just a little less than 200 gems. And uh, still got two dragons, but there's one literally right there. Don't want to... Don't want to die now. I might have jumped. Nope, okay, I got it. Let's see what Lyle has to say. Oh, God. Reading Spyro for an amazing tour to treetops. Don't just stop at one supercharge. Huh. Yeah, I hate that idea. Like, I really hate that idea, Lyle. In fact, Lyle, why don't you fuck off and use that supercharge yourself? Okay, so... Still some gems here. Make sure there's nothing up here before I attempt this. Okay, that'll get me over there, so I'll do that at least. Go ahead and get over there, and then I'll probably have to look up exactly what I need to do next. Hello. Here are both of you guys. Because the dragon I'm missing is way over there. I know, right? I'm gonna have to do some really fancy jumping. I think it is all primarily around here. Oh, hey, I got the trophy. All right. Good feeling. So I guess the trophy was using all the supercharges. I do like that this level has so many lives because they know. They know exactly what they did. Where am I missing? Did I miss one up there? I don't know where I'm missing that. I also don't know how to get out of here, so we're going to get out of here. Aha! That's how I get out of here. And now, I'm going to get back to my dragon friend Lyle, I guess, if you want to call him that. Not a dragon, obviously, he's a dragon, if you want to call him a friend, because friends don't make me do this. But, I'll get back to Lyle, and after that, I will go ahead and offline, what, what is this going to be, a third time in this level, just to figure out how to get that last dragon, and hopefully he has... 90 gems with him. If he doesn't, I am going to be incredibly pissed off. But, I uh, I guess you guys don't need to see me getting back to the house. I will see you guys as soon as I figure out what the fuck I have to do. Okay, this is going to take a lot of attempts, I think, but here goes. So I need to go from here, jump, still in the charge, to here, follow this, jump, Get over here, jump, jump, and hopefully I got it high enough on that. 
Oh, I didn't, but at least I made the jumps. So, let's see how this goes now. Okay, so I know I can do this portion of it. Shoot, I didn't curve. Oh, yeah, I didn't curve quick enough on that one. That was my bad. That's the hard one. Really, that's the hard part. I also don't know, like... This is one of those, I guess, again, talking of... Comparing it to the other game I'm playing in this series right now, Crash. This is kind of the Crash level of, like, what kid would figure out that this is how you do it? Dang it. Like, this is ridiculous. Okay. Tip number three... I almost had it on that first one, though. I'm actually kind of impressed by that, but I might have used my entire mojo on that go. Yep. Yep, that was... Okay. Number four. Again, like the, uh, like the flight episode, I might cut out some of these attempts, so I'll just... Go ahead and dictate. Never mind. <laughs> you better have 90 fucking gems over here. Where are you? What's up, green dude? You know what? I'm gonna get the dragon just in case. Hello, Jed. You can fuck off. That was quite a God, I hate spiral. you. You learned a lot since you were a young glider. Yeah, well, you could have found an easier spot to get stuck. Yeah, he could have. Oh, man. Got him. And that should cap us at 500 of 500. 100% level completion, everyone. I am now going to leave and go ahead and head on to the last level, I guess. I mean, I've got the time, and it will continue the trajectory that we've been on. Uh, that sucks. <laughs> I need to take this slow now instead of just trying to sprint to the exit. Okay, go ahead and take this. Okay. And fly home. Oh. Okay, I have somehow managed pretty well on all this so far. See how the rest of this goes. Okay, so... Nope, you're not blue. Oh, these guys are... Okay, well, I can at least get back to 19. Or I can just take this... I'm gonna get back to 19. Hoo-hoo. How many away... How many am I away? Not now. <laughs> Alright, so we're going to... What is your name? Metalhead. See what Metalhead has in store for us. I've actually been pretty lucky with the trophies in this one, too. It's actually been really fortunate. I was expecting to have to look them up, not accidentally get the trophies. And after this, we can leave the bayou after we finish this. What do we got? One dragon and 500 gems. Okay, sparks. Ooh. Hopefully those guys are not gems that I'm missing now. Yep, they are. Oh, shoot. Screw you. Where's the other one? Okay. Right here. You're not Metalhead, are you? Nope. 
Okay. So far, somehow so good. Missing a couple things over here. And a life. That'll get me back to 20 if I can somehow manage this. Uh, that looks like something I'll have to glide back to later. So let's just... Okay. See if that blows all them up. Hey! And there actually was a chicken for once. Get into that five, 500 a little quicker than I expected, too. Hopefully, boss world should be a little bit easier. Hopefully, I can make this the kind of short level of the episode. Okay, what are we missing? What am I missing, Sparks? Ooh. Okay. Come on. Send him at me. Ah, oh, one of them did get me, though. Got both of them. Got you. There's the dragon. There's got to be a way up. Hey, a chicken. Nice. Got to be a way up for some of this stuff. But I will continue along the level's path the way that it wants me to go. Siddiqui? Metalhead is all charged up to meet you. Attacking the power pole should disrupt his power supply. What? Oh, shoot. Uh, keep on getting those, I guess. Ooh, that was a hit. Okay, I guess I beat him. Well, I did his first room. Don't go down there yet. Can I go up here? Will this, like, take me the stuff? Nice. Ooh. Hello, anything in here? No? Okay. Let's keep going, then. I just gotta keep hitting... His stuff. Ooh, okay. So yeah, don't hit them when they're red. Hello. That's unfair. Unsportsmanlike conduct. Missed one. Got it. Did I beat him? Okay. That was easy. I think there's a gym back here. Yeah, there is. Okay, so I'm still missing... Uh, I believe the proper technical term is a fuck ton of gems. Don't immediately be the go home, please. There's return home. Okay, there's a way up also. So don't go home because I'm still missing... A uh, little, uh, little under 200 gems. Take a look and see. Hello. Please let them all be this easy. Yes. All right. We are now down by less than 150. How did I miss that one? Okay, whatever. Did I miss another one over there? Where are you pointing? I'll come back. Let's check what's out here real quick. Anything up here? Ah, that's where you're pointing. Ah, uh -huh. okay. I'm still missing. How in the world? Okay, there's stuff back there. Is there a path over there? I think there is. Okay, I bet that'll take me back to the beginning of the level two. If I, yeah, if I follow this, I should be able to get back to the beginning of the level, get all the gems, which... Mm, or not, because I don't have a key either. So I gotta find a key now. Hmm. Okay, well... I'm gonna also go back down here to get this one. Uh, is there a key over here? 
Nope. Okay, well, I will offline for a second figure out how to get the 94 gems that I'm missing, and then I will be back, and we'll finish up the episode. So I will see you guys in just a second again. Okay, so I am back here because apparently... Ah, I messed that up by falling, but apparently... This is the stealthy crap they decided to hide in this level. And I lost Sparks attempting to get here, which is no good. But I will go ahead and get all of this stuff. I didn't watch the entire video, so I might be messing myself up even more. But good news, everyone. We know how to get here. And ideally, this will get me the key that I can then... Yep, there's the key. So now... If I take this, it should lift me up high enough to get to the one point in the level I've not been able to get to. I guess the two points. Doing this without sparks kind of sucks. Okay. Please make it. All right, Spyro, I believe in you. <laughs> okay, so now if I go back to the end of the level... I should... Is there a chicken here? Ah, Sparks is back, everyone. And this should let me get to the 500 gems relatively easily. I just gotta run back here. Go through the first room. So I'm missing 39. Hopefully there's 39. Hopefully all 39 are up here. <laughs> It's a really specific number, and I have little faith in it actually being 39, but we'll see. Fifteen. Okay, fifteen gems somewhere, everyone. Let's see. Where the hell? All right, let me go this way. I miss them back here. Okay, this is no fun at this point. He is pointing that way. Did I miss... Miss something back here? Aha, uh -huh, I did. And that looks like it's going to be 15. All right. So. That'll do it. And that's the trophy. So we do not have to worry about having to look anything else up, which means while I leave, I can go ahead and call the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, feel free to like, subscribe, and share, and enable notifications so we can stay on content. Next time, we're going to head to the new world. We are continuing our two-and-done streak in Spyro, which is both happy and sad, because happy, it means I am making great progress in time. Sad, it means I am a step closer to going back to Crash Bandicoot. But... I hope everybody has enjoyed the episode, and if this is your first time watching, go ahead and click the video there in the corner. It'll take you back to the beginning of Spire of the Dragon, and if you like what you see, go ahead and head over to my video section where you can check out any other games that I've played, and there's a lot of great stuff also coming down the pike. But in the meantime, I hope everybody stays safe, and I will see you all next time.